In this video, we're going to be having a look at some of the interaction between incident management and problem management within Hornbill's Service Manager application. So we start by going over to our request list, and here we have a list of existing incidents. And I'm just going to filter this down by uh, VPN issues. And I'm just going to open up this uh, particular issue at the top of our list. Now, as an incident owner, I'm able to uh, to go through and search for related records, um, whether they be incidents or problems, to my issues. So I'm just going to again type in VPN, and here's our uh, results for that search. Now we see there's a an existing known error that's come up, and here I can sort of view some summary details, and I can also uh, view the the request in its entirety. But if I'm happy that this might be related, I can just click on the linked option. We also see a closed problem and an open problem, and in this case, I'm also going to select that open problem as a potential uh, related uh, issue. Now, this has uh, provided me now with a solution option within my incidents, and here we see that that linked known error has actually provided us with some workaround steps in order to try to resolve this particular incident. So I have a choice of either accepting the solution, if I've tested this out with the customer and we're aware that it's now worked and fixed their, their issue, or we can select it as not the solution if we haven't had any luck. And in this case, I'm just going to select not the solution. Now we can also look at this from a problem management perspective. So I'm just going to uh, switch back over to my request list, and I'm going to go over to our problem list. Now here we have a problem uh, again around the VPN, and if we just open this up, and on each problem record you have an option of adding a workaround to this particular issue. So I'm just going to add in uh, uh, to state that if you install the latest version of this software, this might uh, fix your issue. And we just click on Save. Now this particular problem, if we look down at our linked uh, uh, requests, we'll see that this was uh, already linked in with that uh, initial uh, incident. And so now the incident owner should be able to return back to that incident. And in, in addition to the original known error workaround, if we click on this solution option, we now see the solution provided to us by that problem record that we just updated. So again, we can see the summary details, and if we uh, have tested this and feel this is the accepted solution, we can click on this. And what this will do is this will bring us straight through to the resolution tab, copy over the, uh, the workaround details, and allow us to quickly resolve uh, this particular request.